the small city of Berkeley, California sits Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory. And this lab is an astronomer, Clifford Stoll, who in 1986 was assigned to discover who had used 75 cents worth of internet time on this private server. Cliff was determined to find out who could be hacking this system and why they wanted access to scientific research. Could it be someone in the office in Berkeley? Why was Hunter looking at emails and salaries? Or is it a hacker from Oakland? The first call trace Cliff does brings him to this conclusion, but the coding style is not reminiscent of the California coding style. He has to be from somewhere else. Next, Hunter hacked into the Aniston Army Department in Alabama. The hacker could be coming from anywhere and is getting serious with his victims. Hunter was next unsuccessful at hacking into White Sands New Mexico military base. Now Hunter is showing trends in his hacking victims. Is it someone within the U.S. military trying to expose them? Is it some sort of genius student who wants to rebel? Or is Cliff dealing with a bigger problem? A problem that led him to the CIA in McLean, Virginia. Now the hacker is coming through or starting in the city that the headquarters the CIA. Cliff knows he has to move quickly if he wants to secure the entire online world in America. The last phone call track leads Cliff to Western Germany, specifically Hanover, Germany. After 10 months and hundreds of tracks, could Cliff have finally been successful? Could the man behind Hunter really be someone hired by the KGB to hack American military servers? Had he finally found his Hunter?